Hey guys, today I'm sharing three incredible ways to clean with pine salt. If you've heard of all of these, I will be shocked. Yes, I pour this directly into my washing machine. Stick around, you don't wanna miss it. I've been cleaning with Pine Salt for years, and no, this is not sponsored by Pine Salt. I also equally love the competitor, Pine Allen. This was like $5. I, first of all, love Pine Salt for use in the bathroom. It smells so fresh. It acts as a disinfectant. It says right on here, kills 99.9% .9 of germs and even that nasty virus that's going around. I use this to help sanitize my toilet bowl cleaners. And here's a great trick, especially if you have guests coming over, you wanna freshen up that bathroom so fast. Just put a splash of this right in your toilet and then use your toilet wand to clean it. Your bathroom will smell amazing. It's being disinfected at the same time and it is fast. I'm talking like this is like a little bit of a knockoff of poopery. Just keep this in your bathroom. You will not regret it. Next, you may not know, you can use pine salt to clean your carpet, especially if you have pets, dogs, or cats. Urine that gets into the carpet, sometimes animals tend to go over and over in the same spot. They are attracted to the scent of ammonia, but this is going to help deter them. But historically, I used to be afraid to dilute chemicals. Like, this is very concentrated, and I was like, I don't know if I can do that. It is really easy, friends. It is just a quarter cup of pine salt per gallon of water, or what I like to say, a little splashy dash in a bowl, mix it up, it gets nice and sudsy, and then you can just rinse off your carpet, pat it dry, and then vacuum as normal. I get told by you all the time the cleaners you don't like. So many of you say you hate the smell of vinegar. Lots of you say you don't even like the smell of fabuloso. But for some reason, pine salt seems to be a favorite of a lot of people. Let me know if you feel the same. And we are diving right in to using pine salt on your laundry. I stumbled across a TikTok video, McMullen Appliance and Mattress. This guy is just hustling for his business, did like hours of research on pine salt. I will link it down below. It boils down to this. Pine salt has glycolic acid and it works really well for your laundry. And like you, I am a skeptic of these hacks. I'm like, this feels like a fire hazard for most of them. But this one is actually right on the Pine Soul bottle. It says you can use it to clean laundry. It works really well for grease and oil stains. If you've got crazy stains, you're gonna love this in the laundry room. This is really great if your kids play sports or maybe someone in your family works a construction job. I'm just gonna take a little bit of this, just pop it right on the stain just like that. This is an oil stain. Give it like a quick rub if you can. No more stain. That was oil too. But you can also use it as a laundry booster. Depending on the size of your machine, about a half cup will do, stick it in. Yes, you just put your regular detergent in with it. And I was a skeptic. I was a skeptic. I thought my entire load was going to smell straight up like pine salt, but I had some very soiled towels. Remember, we have a dog. And it came out smelling great. It's so affordable. And if you don't want that, you can also use Pine Allen. This thing was literally $5 from the hardware store. It's effectively the same thing and it says right on the back how to use it for your laundry definitely if you want to give it a try and let me know what you think but they do smell good <laughs> thank you does it smell hotelish that was what i thought i honestly have never smelled a hotel towel <laughs> i smell hotel towels all the time well if they smell like this they must smell pretty good because <laughs> they were super musty before <laughs> thanks babe no I'm so glad you made it here today. Leave this video a thumbs up. Show that algorithm some love for me. It really means so much. If nobody has told you, you're enough. And I'll catch you in the next video. Bye. Are we showing this? <laughs> yes, the internet has the facade of perfect and we tell the truth. Oh, yeah. Copper?